On the table, Minecraft minifigures, Endstone series 6, dig in 3 packs. It seems like just a few days ago you reviewed series 5 ice and series 2 stone. I know, but I squirrel you not, Barry. I found this series 6 only a few hours after posting the ice series and stone series. It was crazy. Oh, poor Squirrel Stampede. Are you mocking me? Every day. Hey, how come the packages are so bent up? That's a good question, Barry. When I picked these up off the store shelves, they looked like they had just been hammered around. But I'll take them, as so far they've been pretty hard to find. Just get on with opening these. All right, all right, enough wasting time. Let's start opening these. That's what I just said. Ah! So these dig in three packs are your best bet for collecting most of the minifigures, especially now that the codes on these mystery boxes are a little bit scrambled. You can no longer trust these letters based off what we find in the boxes. Unless you find your own package set and pull out all letters, will you be able to find all the characters without repeats? Pulling codes online is a little trickier. Of course there are those four exclusive figures in the boxes that you won't be able to get in the three packs. Checking out the back of the box here, it shows off the four different collections of three packs you can find. And again, it highlights down here the four figures exclusive to the mystery boxes. Life is a puzzle. Let's open these packs up now and see what's inside. Shouldn't be too hard as these packs have been pretty well pummeled. Are you still talking? Open them! All right. What are you doing now? This is not a ball and three shells game. Okay, the collection outside of the package. I think the two most worthwhile figures for you probably would be Steve and Alex with their shields and armor. They'll take you to great places of your imagination. And I'm still thinking if I like this potion drinking witch. The Exploding Creeper is probably the most graphic figure of the collection. A lot of fun with that. Caught in time of an explosion. Then there's the Shulker. Make sure you have it upright in the right position. That would be wrong and you can tell by the little groove on the base there. So easy to flip that guy upside down. And then there's my favorite, the Pig in the Minecart. So cool. I'd love to see more of these characters in minecarts. By the way, what is cuter? Pig in minecart or pig in Hot Wheels minecart? Pig in minecart. Pig in Hot Wheels minecart. Pig in minecart. Pig in Hot Wheels cart. Buh, just took out the spectral damage to zombie. Who has a bent arrow, by the way. Not all of these minifigures are perfect. Okay, what we have been waiting for, the exclusives to the three packs. We have the Skull Firing Wither. We have the Spawning Skeleton. We have the Endermites. And we have the Cave Spider in Volleyball Nets. No, no, Cave Spider in Webs. I say Volleyball Nets because in creative mode I made a Volleyball Net out of spider webs in the backyard. These are pretty good looking exclusives to the three packs. What is going on with the wither? Here would be a regular wither up against this skull firing wither. He's more blue. Obviously a skull is coming out of the main body there. A little bit of transparency too on that front skull that's coming out of him. Pretty cool figure. I like the ones with the clear bases, how they float about. Looks pretty interesting. Then we have the spawning skeleton and it is on fire. Skeleton's probably about three quarters the size of a minifigure, maybe just a little smaller. I don't want to say he's half the size, but he is a little bit smaller. It'd be fun to pry him out of there and then have a little mini skeleton. Then we have the ultra exciting Endermites here. Looks like the kind of toy you accidentally grab for an eight hour road trip and then go, oh, why did I grab the Endermites? But at least they seem to be doing a good job licking off that pond scum on that block. Then we have the ultra layered cave spider in webs again, a real clever bluish spider sitting on a smaller block with webs. 
This one is actually another great detailed one, very similar to the Creeper exploding. A lot of work went into that one, I imagine. I like the detail they put into these webs. You can see all the little squares of texture going on. A lot of fun. It would have been neat if instead of a little block in there, you could have just squeezed it around, say, another minifigure's head to start spidering them up. So, good looking for exclusives for the three packs. Minecraft Minifigures and Stone Series 6 3 packs available on store shelves Fall 2016. Another great set of minifigures for the Minecraft world. Great exclusives included the spawning skeleton, the skull firing wither, the cave spider in webs, and of course, the toy you want to take everywhere with you forever, Endermites. That's what I have to say about that. I could use those Ender Mites to clean up my logo a bit. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. Please, like, share, subscribe. Hmm, I wonder. Ha <laughs> 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 wow, that is, that is too cute. Oh no, it's too cute. The world, the world seems to be collapsing. Oh no, what's going on? What's going on? Whoa!